Hello once again, everybody, and welcome to Hurricane Spring Football. I'm Joe Zagacki as we come to you from the Green Tree practice field. A good day of work for the Hurricanes as the scrimmage is coming up on Thursday. We were keeping our eyes on wide receiver Rayshon Scott, trying to come back from some bad luck the last couple of years. Two years ago, Scott had 35 catches for over 500 yards and three touchdowns. Scott will be an important element in this year's offense as we find out. Plus, we take a further look at today's action. As I stride, don't forget to stride and drive. You did it right there. It's the difference on the throw. Work it, work it, work it, work it, work it. Good feet in the pocket. Good feet in the pocket. Good feet in the pocket. Come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Work the pocket. Work that pocket. Work it. Oh, there it is. Work that pocket. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. There it is. There it is. There it is. We're now joined by University of Miami wide receiver Rayshon Scott and Rayshon back after I would say two years of bad luck, right? So here you are in spring football, having an impact. How much are you embracing just every rep and every opportunity that you're getting right now? Oh, well, you know, I'm just studying more. Um, I'm making all the opportunities I could get and it's even making me better just helping a young guy study It's just making me remember it more. Now I can help them even if they're on the field and I could make play calls myself towards the young boys. They say that the team that has the most fun or the players that have the most fun win. And every time I see you here in the spring, you got a big smile on your face and it looks like you're enjoying this process. Oh yes, you know, the coaches are believing in me and that's one thing I have learned from him that I got to believe in myself before anybody else could believe in me. So I'm just going to keep fighting towards that. Of course, uh, you have Brad Kaya and working out the timing uh, with your quarterback and how is that going? Oh, great. Um, that's my boy. Uh, me and Brad connected very well. You know, we go out here and there. Uh, we talk a lot, you know, just to get on the right path. If we watch the film, we see something, we'll text each other and get it right. Now, this year you got a lot of competition at wide receiver. I'll probably leave somebody out here. We got Stacey Coley and Herb Waters and Braxton Berrios. Got a lot of different choices, and so it's good competition every day, isn't it? Oh, every, every day is a good competition, but you know you want the best for everybody, and we all just going to go out there and compete, and you know you got them little miscues with each other, but we want family, so it's all going to be fun. All right, we have a uh, scrimmage coming up. Uh, that's going to be the next deal, and then going forward, you have the scrimmage, and then the rest of spring, what do you want to get accomplished? Um, Just my blocking, just being more physical. That's what I got to do, work on my blocking, getting, attacking him and not lunging, so that's how I see it. All right, well, it's been fun to watch you. Uh, welcome back and stay healthy. Thank you. All right, that's wide receiver Rayshon Scott. We'll continue now with our plays of the day. Brad Kaya on the move down the sidelines. Rayshon Scott tiptoes the sidelines. That's a beautiful catch. Here comes the newcomer, Jaquan Johnson, off the edge for a sack. Joe Yerby is breathtaking, like tackling smoke. Here's Kaya with a majestic pass. Herb Waters, a tremendous over-the-shoulder catch. Watch number 17, Tyreek McCord. He has an interception, and those are the plays of the day. 
So the hope with Rayshon Scott this year is that he will bring his experience and chunk plays to this offense. Don't forget, Sun Life Stadium is undergoing renovations. You can find out more about those renovations right here on HurricaneSports.com. And for your ticket information, 1-800-GO-CANES or CanesTicks.com. The Canes are back out on the field on Thursday. It will be their first scrimmage of this spring. We'll see you next time right here on HurricaneSports.com. Touchdown! Touchdown! 